Surprise, Internet. Man, it's another late night stream, huh? Old habits die hard, man. It's, uh... I'm awake. I don't know how else to explain it, man. I'm just awake. I'm not supposed to be. I'm supposed to be tired, and I'm supposed to be going to bed, and, uh... All that good stuff, you know? And I, it's... I've only got three days left of, uh, unemployment, and then the job starts. And I'm gonna have to be up at, like, fucking 6, 7 o'clock in the morning. So, uh, this is wildly a bad idea, but, you know, if I can't sleep, I can't sleep, right? This is how it is. Uh, I'm not really one for beating myself over the head or forcing things not natural to happen. So, uh, if I am awake and I'm supposed to be asleep, I'm awake. <laughs> I'm just gonna be awake. Uh, good news is that means I could stream a little bit. I kind of got wrapped up in some things today. I still have... It's not like I have a lot going on, but I just wanted to take care of a few things here and there, and I got lazy on the couch for the rest of it, so I just didn't stream. Uh, but, you know, a couple things. I missed a few things that I wanted to do, so I'll just try and get them done tomorrow. I, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do in terms of, like, getting my stream in order. Well, not my stream, but my, uh, sleeping in order. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure what my go-to tactic should be. I might need to take the next couple of days off from streaming just to get into it. I mean, I've been trying to do it all, you know, all vacation long, right? I mean, it's been over two weeks, I think, now. Yeah, I think so. Because now we're moving into Friday, and I was off the week before last Thursday. So it's been two weeks for me to get my shit in gear, and I have not been able to do it. Just haven't been able to do it. It's one of the hardest things with me is uh, changing my sleep. I'm just, I've always been terrible at it. So, it's a strong chance that I'll just have to show up. Uh, I'll just have to show up at work and be tired as fuck and just go th get through the day. And that's usually how I do it. You know? Spotted Peggy's moving against Elliot's place. Let's move before we're too. Did I get that? Spotted Peggy's moving against Elliot's place. Let's move before we're too late. Oh, weird. Uh, so yeah, you know, that's just, just enough of been kind of the deal. Mm. Not a whole lot else going on with me. I mean, I'm just trying to get into the groove of things. And we only got three days left before I'm back on that, you know, fucking grind. I've got another job to balance and do the streaming and just the fucking working and everything yeah it's really tough it's really tough you know like i've i've been streaming for four years and i think for, perhaps for the first two years of it i didn't have to work so much i was able to kind of keep things afloat i didn't have to work so much but in the last two years my stream has really been you know the stream time has just greatly lessened but i have grown so, it's not like a huge thing, but boy, I really do miss <laughs> having so much stream time. I really do. All those things that I normally would think about, you know, I kind of have to sit here and think, do I really want to play this today? You know, this or that. Do I have the gumption? You know, can I stick with fighting games and shit? Normally, it's just like a no-brainer. It's like, dude, you got nothing else to do and you've got time. Fucking sit down and stream this game and see if you can get better at it. You know, it was easy peasy. Hasn't really been the case these days. <laughs> it's uh, it's a different beast. When you have a job and you're trying to stream, it's a definitely different beast. Mm. Trying to figure out what I want to do. Let's go ahead and take care of this. So I, honestly, this game has been... Uh, it's really losing its charm, man. I got one more region left. I don't know if I got it in me to beat it. But uh, there's not really much else to be playing, you know? I got the... Oh my god, I just fucked up real big time. Oh yeah. Yeah, that was a big time fuck up right there. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking. I just pressed the fucking square button out of nowhere. Alright. Well, we mostly made it to our destination. Not a huge deal. 
Find a way to get into the pump room. Do I have my dog? Yes. Alright, cool. He'll help me out. Yeah, I mean, uh, the game's alright. It's just, you know, you really, it really does wear out after a while. You're just, I'm just like, alright, you know, kind of, I kind of get what I'm doing, and it's a lot of the same thing over and over. Who saw me? Yeah, he saw me? Well, that didn't work out well. Man, these guys are sharp shooters. this together somehow. Kind of lose them a little bit. Not too shabby. What is with all this butt hash flying around? Irritating. Man, I clipped like, or not clipped, but I like <laughs> trimmed my nose hairs, right? Because I was fucking getting all getting all wild up in there, starting to itch and scratch during the day, you know, just getting all weird. I'm like, alright, alright, I'll take care of this. I shaved it all, and now it's all, like, prickly in there, and it's still bugging the hell out of me in a totally different way. <laughs> like, what the hell, man? That was supposed to solve the problem. This made it worse. Well, maybe not worse, but it's just as irritating as if I hadn't done anything. It's, like, seriously distracting right now. Ah, I see, I see. I get what I'm supposed to be doing. Easy peasy. Just gotta climb through the sewers, of course. It smells a little bit like shit, but that's not a big deal, right? Damn, you can speed swim? Nice! I didn't know you could do this. Oh, yes. There we go. Think we got bad guys in here? You can stop the water, but you can't stop the bliss. Ah, of course. the pump in each building? Oh, uh, you're a pump, and you're a pump. Nice. Alright. 
but I probably need to take another dip, right? Jesus, what is that sound? What the heck is that sound? Man, internet, are you okay? So loud! Man, that was wild. I don't even know if you guys could hear me while I was talking. Jeez, that like completely took over the entire stream. What the hell was that? Oh my god, it's still happening. I hope that's- oh man, is that like a bug? I can't even swim through here. Sorry, I don't know why it's so loud. <laughs> this is terrible. Can I turn it off or something? I don't even see where I'm going. I'm sorry, I don't know why that was so loud. It's still loud. I'm just gonna mute the game so that you guys can hear it through my microphone instead of through the game because it's just so awful. It's gotta be a bug or something, right? Weird. Ubisoft strikes again, huh? Ugh. It's still very loud. It's a little bit better, but not really. Nice. That worked out really well. Where's my puppy? There he is. Let's get out of this butt hash. <sighs> okay. Internet, I'm sorry about that. That was uh, that was extremely loud. I I do not know why that was so awful. Could have been a bug. That's what I keep thinking. It's just got had to be some sort of a weird sound bug. Damn. Some of these shots do look really nice though, right? 
Like the woods and everything. <laughs> Pretty good. Not too bad. I, I'll give it up. It's not normally something I uh, like out of this game, but sometimes you look at the force just right and it looks really good. Damn, what's this music starting up for? Oh yeah, find something else to do. Uh, let's go do that. See if we can knock out some stuff tonight. Ow! Oh jeez, I survived? Yeah, I thought that would kill me. Man, you really can't get that thing open very fast, huh? I guess they don't want you to really abuse it too much. Yeah, this magnum is not working very well, is it? Doesn't seem to really uh, do the one shot that I was hoping it would do. It's got a nice jump there. Oh, really? Oh, jeez. I just barely scraped the floor. <laughs> I don't know. I, you know. Why did I think it was going to kill me? I didn't think it was going to kill me at all. I didn't think I was going to die. Keep your parachute open and... Oh, man. I mean, I don't know. It just didn't seem like I would die on that. That, that didn't seem like I was going that fast. I honestly thought I could get enough height to skirt the, t <laughs> the, the ground and kind of go over it, but it didn't work. Fuck. All right, whatever. Uh, I mean, the game's really losing its charm. What in the hell? Uh, wild. Alright. Let's grab a car this time. It's gotta be one, right? No? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Whatevs. Man, that's what I get for fucking around, right? Should have just gone there. Target in sight. That's what I wanted last time. Air support is coming in. There we go. That was sick. Freed of gullet. How's it going, man? Fucking uh, late night stream. Sure I really shouldn't be having these anymore, so, but here's the deal. I can't the get any sleep, so fuck it. We'll go stream. They <laughs> need the best day. Ah, uh, the stupid airplane is still attacking. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. To be honest, Freed, this game is uh, kind of wearing out a bit on me. I don't know if I got enough left. I don't know if I got enough juice to uh, take care of the last region of this game. Best damn drink you've ever tasted, McKellen Fifty Seven. But to bring me my family's long lost whiskey, and I'll reward you handsomely. All right, whiskey in a cask. Fifteen barrels in the lake. The hell? I don't even have an. Oh my god! I don't want to do this. This is another collectathon quest. So I don't want to bother. Hello. I'm not gonna bother collectathoning. I'm just gonna go. This is the only time I can show up. Oh really? Shit! I'm sorry. <laughs> You know, I, uh, I got a job that's going to be kicking in in about three days. And uh, it's going to be a morning routine, man. Uh, so this kind of thing is going to be the way of the dodo soon. You know? I, I should already be on a morning schedule, but I can't seem to get myself into it. Stop your Mama! <laughs> so, you know, I'm sorry about that, man. I won't be able to do these kind of streams on a, a normal 
basis. I'll probably do them on, uh, you know, days off, but... It's gonna be morning work for me. I get home at around like five or six or something like that, and then you know it's gonna be a kind of after dinner stream until about midnight, and that'll be that. I am I am thinking stash about stop playing it. I didn't really Someone know what to do to tonight. Okay. Uh, I had you know I was awake. And I well, wanted to do yeah. something, so this seemed like the easiest game to just kind of fire up and go. But yeah, I am definitely considering some other options. Maybe there's something else I want to play. I'm not sure. Onimusha 3. Some more Tekken, maybe. Just kind of put my efforts into that. <coughs> Dank Dungeon. Dank's Dungeon. I might have to give it a look, man. I don't know. Again, it's on, it's on the list. KOTOR 2 is on that list, too, man. We can play that. Can we do this on your days off? ND mine and mine I'm okay with this well you know I don't know what your days off are man but uh, you know I stream when I you know I don't have a schedule so I stream when I stream and fucking I just try and uh, I just try and stream as much as I can that's all I can really promise to be honest. I stream as much as I possibly can the only times I don't stream is when I'm too busy, like, eating big dinner or, uh, being naked and masturbating, you know? Those are the only times I don't do it. And mostly because those, uh, the last one is kind of against Twitch Terms of Service. Start up Danka's Dungeon? Jesus Christ. You know, I'm tired, man, but I'm not that tired. <laughs> oh, fuck. Ooh, a Puma. That was a little scary. I wasn't sure if that guy was going to fuck me up or not. DD or Kortor dude, please, is not this. <laughs> well, you know, I'll give it some real consideration next time uh, I stream. Tonight, let me turn my brain off and just shoot some dudes. And, uh, well, I'll give it some real thought. You know, Kotor 2 or... I was thinking of Onimusha 3. I actually have a PlayStation and a PlayStation 2 emulator. And uh, I picked up Onimusha 3, so I'm kind of... I'm kind of interested in starting that up, you know? It's got it's kind of cool. I thought it was a fun game. Maybe I can really enjoy it, you know? that shit is so please don't no. <laughs> uh, mm, you don't you've never seen Onimusha huh man it's a good game it's a good series of games the it was it was kind of a uh, Resident Evil style game <clears throat> it was a Resident Evil style game but it took place uh, you were a samurai so you got to engage in kind of a sword combat type of stuff it was a pretty straightforward beat em up but it had the fixed camera angles and stuff. It had that kind of Resident Evil type of thing. Not really survival horror, but, you know, it was a beat-em-up that didn't give you a lot of health. So you did have to be pretty good. What? Man, I hate how they can do that. The shit just spawns random enemies out of nowhere. It's so lame. Huh? Where'd my damn marker go? Hello, this is Ms. Mabel. There it is. Uh, it was a pretty popular game back in the day. Sorry, my brain's not really... I'm awake, but my brain is just kind of in that state of not really paying attention. Anyways, fuck about that stuff, man. I'll figure out something to play. You know that. But what I want to ask you is, uh, you don't care about Street Fighter V, right? You're not a fan, right? Do you follow the fighting game stuff free? Do you care about the people? Are you familiar with the movers and shakers? Because uh, they recently announced a very, very strange thing on uh, E League that they, apparently they're going to be taking uh, a couple of 
well-known Street Fighter V players. Not even well-known, but they're like, they're not even really Street Fighter V players exactly. They're like old-school FGC people. <laughs> and they put them on a reality TV show. It's an actual reality TV show, like an actual thing. It's it's like uh, MTV's The Real World. <laughs> One of those people, and I, I'm almost certain that you've heard of the guy, is a uh, low tier god. Low tier god is gonna be on this fucking reality show where I guess these people are all just gonna play. They're all gonna fight it out on Street Fighter Five, and then whoever wins gets a special invitational to. Capcom Pro Tour, so that they can be, uh, you know, registered to play at the Pro Tour. Not at all, but I do actually respect the genre as a sport. All right. Well, I mean, you're probably familiar with some of these people, like Sherry Jenix. Never mind. I don't care what you Who are you? I need, I need to talk. talk. Those miserable shits raided my place trying to kill my peaches. Yeah, okay, I don't care. Oh. So you're too good for me, huh? Just go find my goddamn peaches. Damn, this bitch is angry. All right, let's go find our goddamn peaches. Millions of peaches. Yeah, so basically, Low Tier God is like a huge heel, right? He's like a... <laughs> He's got some funny shit to say because he's like this giant asshole. Or at least he plays an asshole on stream. I've heard that he's not actually an asshole in real life, but he streams like one. And yeah, he's just a giant asshole. I don't know how else to put it. Like, I guess a troll or something. But anyways, the guy is whatever. But uh, he is... He is so... He has such a negative opinion on uh, everything that having him on the show is like... Really, really wild, especially because this is an actual TV show. I live on a rock called video game, so like the briefest way I could get it, I could say it is basically the way I did. He is just a guy who streams, but he's very vocal and very hateful. You know, he's he's a troll. He's like a real life caricature of a troll or something. I don't know if it's actually a character or, or if he actually is like that, but he he loves talking a bunch of shit. Uh, and it, it can be kind of funny. You know, he's got some funny things to say, but most of it is just really over-the-top, you know, hateful humor type of thing. You know, it's kind of strange. It doesn't have a whole lot of taste to it. It's just a lot of yelling and a lot of calling people out for being retarded or something. A shit poster. It, pretty much, a shit poster. That's a good way of saying it, too. Yeah, shit poster. But not like you, no, not like you, though. You, you're, you're, you're tr you try to be tasteful. You try and be relevant. You try and be creative. This guy really is not that much those things. <laughs> he's, he's really just a guy who gets a lot of views for complaining and raging a lot. I guess that's a good way of putting it. In any case, he's going to be on the show. A reality show. He's going to be on the reality show with this person who is uh, guilty. And I believe she is one of those people who wasn't a she when she first uh, was at character creation. So she had a spat with Low Tier God. Like, at some point, Low Tier God started talking lots of shit about her. And so now she's on the show, too, and those two have to live in the same house and be a part of this reality TV show. So it's already like there's this huge drama thing kicking in, and it's ridiculous. And this, this is all going to be on TV. All going to be on TV. It's ridiculous. There's trolls who are fuckers trying to convince people on the internet to end themselves, and then there's assholes. And then there's shit posters. I guess he's probably a mix of the first two, is what I'm thinking. Good shit poster? Yeah, okay. Alright, that works. I mean, whatever it is that you view it, it definitely is its own kind of asylum, this guy, and what he does. In any case, it sounds like they're really trying to drum up some drama with this shit, and uh, it's kind of worked. In fact, it's really kind of worked. There's a lot of people who are pretty pissed about what's going on right now. It's like the talk of the town, you know? Because it's a it's a televised event, so it's going to be on TV properly. Have to equip.
Hey, where is, uh... Oh, here it is. So I gotta lead her back with her treats. Hmm. Maybe I could just like hold it or something. I only have three of these though. Hmm. I wonder how I'm supposed to do this. Weird. Alright, alright. So, uh. How do I get more of her treats? I guess I gotta go back. <laughs> yeah, that was really weird. You're getting too far from Peaches. Well, tell me how to get more of Peaches' meat and we can talk. Jesus Christ. It won't let me... Uh... Oh, I have infinite. I didn't even see that. Right here. Right here. Damn, I thought I only had three. Wow, that's so weird. I wonder how I fucked that up. Usually I'm so observant. This is stupid, by the way. This is really dumb. <laughs> At least he's keeping up with me, though, so it works. As really, really odd as this is. Uh oh, am I going the right way? Yeah, I think so. Maybe. No, let's go back up here. This cat is noisy as fuck. But yeah, anyways, that kind of shit is pretty funny. It's creating some waves. People getting pissed about it. Maximilian made a video. Oh my god. Maximilian made a video about some shit. Hang on, let me kill these guys and we'll talk. See the pen, huh? Where's the pen? Over here? Cool. Alright. Do not shit here, teachers. No shitting. I hope you're happy. You had me so worried, you little shit. You're sharper than you look. I'll be honest. What a bitch. I figured I'd never see you again. Thought you were a little dim in the headlights. Fine. <laughs> Take the piece of shit, cat. It's your fucking <laughs> He gives me the cat, huh? Wow. Thanks for hire, huh? Weird. Alright. So yeah, Maximilian made a video. You know Maximilian? He's, he's the guy who's like... 
kind of a not really like a leading FGC guy, but. Uh, what was I saying? I like my dog. I'm not really a cat person either. Uh, yeah, Maximilian. He is a dude that does a lot of videos and shit. Tula, how's it going, man? He's a sellout? Or am I a sellout? <laughs> Maximilian, I don't know if you can call Maximilian a sellout because he was like a sellout way before he ever got the Twitch, right? Like, he was a sellout from day negative one. <laughs> he, he established what it means to be a sellout before esports was selling out. <laughs> uh, but in general, Maximilian is kind of like a big popular Twitch streamer that likes to advocate fighting games. Let's put it like that. An actual battle? Yeah. So, Maximilian made a video recently about Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. And uh, basically, he just said that the game that it's over, that the game is dead, and uh, Capcom is not supporting it, and he has no faith at all that it's going to go anywhere, and that it's done. Basically, he's saying the game is dead. The game's dead. Uh, I guess this was so infuriating to a certain group of people that I don't know about uh, that they are now sending him death threats. So I guess he got death threats over. Over Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite being dead. And I'm over here thinking, like, I have two videos. I have two videos shitting on Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. One before it came out, and one maybe, like, not even a week after it came out. Wholeheartedly and without reserve shitting on both Marvel and all the people who shilled Marvel. Which I think was like, uh, I think Justin Wong was on that bandwagon. I think Justin Wong was on it, uh, and I think F Champ was on it. I can't quite remember who was who. But it is such a shitty game. that w Exactly, it's a shitty game. It is such a bad game when it came out, I couldn't help but shit on it. Because it was a bad game. It looked bad and it didn't play all that great. I think it got a little bit better. A little bit. They tweaked it a little bit here and there. They only had like one patch for it, but... I think when people figured out how to play it, it maybe it kind of eased up a little bit. They changed Dante or something. I can't quite remember. In any case, Lord of Chaos was a fan of that game. Uh, is a fan? Was a fan? Basically, he got death threats. Or Maximilian got death threats. And I didn't get any death threats at all. I have two videos shitting on the game. I don't got any death threats. What the fuck? I want death threats. <laughs> Fucking, I'm shitting on the game too. It's like everybody shits on that game, though. But for some reason, him shitting on it got him death threats. This is Adelaide at the marina. Pretty fucking weird, huh? I wish he never resurfaced that game. <laughs> what if Chaos loves all the shitty fighters? He really does. He's a fucking... He's basically an anime player at this point. He's basically an anime player. He just fucking loves those really shitty games. I'm a goddamn Smash player, and I know that game's utter dog shit. <laughs> it's really awful, isn't it? Like, holy shit. It's just a bad game. It was badly put together. It had no money. I mean, they didn't give a shit. They didn't... Capcom maybe tried to give a shit at one point, but it was very clear that the other side did not give a shit. What was that? Damn. So I wanted up here so that I can get out of the car and do this. Jeez, that's not quite how I wanted it. Shit. Man, this sucks. Use a med kit. Oh boy. I didn't think I was taking that much damage. I was really trying to fly out of here, but I didn't work out. Fuck. Well, we tried, right? Never stairs. Whatever. We're trying to take over something. I'm not worried about this right now. You guys have a car? Yes, you do. Street Fighter V is definitely garbage. Do you have a reason for saying that? Well, Street Fighter V is definitely garbage. Uh, God, what is the biggest thing about it? 
I think the biggest reason that it's garbage is the same reason that I... It's the same thing I quote other people saying, right? It doesn't have very encouraging, like, mechanics to it. If you try and play a basic game of Street Fighter and Street Fighter V, it doesn't work out that well. This gun can really hurt if you're like really close. Jesus, my fucking dog! Do you see that? <laughs> so the reason I think it sucks is the reason like I hear a lot of people say it sucks. You can't play like a good basic game of Street Fighter. That is because like every button you do. Wow, this fucking shit is getting crazy. Everything you do is like designed to not let you do another thing immediately after it so like if you your 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 buttons are really stubby so they don't have very good range right they just they don't reach very far grabs don't reach very far they're very short so you have to get really up in their face the game has like virtually no defensive options for most of the cast so the people who do have more defensive options are like instantly blown up at the top as being really good mm. The walk speed is abysmal. The walk speed is abysmal. And because the fucking... <laughs> because the fucking uh, stubby nature of the limbs in Street Fighter V, because they're so stubby, it gives rise to the inability to properly whiff punish people. So if they like sit there in the corner and they're throwing out buttons... It's difficult. It's very difficult to punish them whiffing those buttons. Simply because your your buttons are going to be stubby. So, some characters' buttons aren't that stubby, though. And so those characters are instantly pushed to the top as being great. There's more stuff to it. The problem is, is I don't really play Street Fighter V anymore. And even when I did, I didn't play it well. I don't know how to play Street Fighter V. The only reason I go to these as my go-to why I think Street Fighter V is bad is because professionals who do play Street Fighter V say that these are things that are bad. And when I play Street Fighter V, I am kind of frustrated that I can't reach people and that my character is bad. That's honestly all I could really come up with. But the, the design of the game is basically to make it so, like, skill is less applicable to the game and more kind of a random crush counter nature is really what they want you to do. And it kind of leads to sort of... It really leads to an unga bunga mindset, right? Like, here's another thing. You can jump in on a guy five or six times, and each and every time the guy anti-airs you, right? Anti-airing. That's, that's virtually... That's like what Street Fighter created, anti-airs. Knock them out of the sky, right? Stop them from jumping in on you. That's a basic Street Fighter thing. You want to do that in every Street Fighter. But in Street Fighter V, if you were to anti-air up to five or six times... The damage that you did over that five or six times does not equal the damage of one successful jump in on you with a heavy attack or even like a medium attack. If you fail to anti-air a guy for the seventh time, if you did it all properly six times, but then you fail to do it the seventh and he hits you with a jump in attack, you are going to take more damage than the other guy did from failing, from being knocked out of the air five to six times you're gonna take more damage so the reward aspect of trying to anti-air and failing to and getting hit like the re the risk and reward factor is really heavily skewed towards jumping which is almost universally considered a bad thing when you are learning street fighter like one of the very first things you want to learn about street fighter is not to jump you want to learn when you can jump and you want to keep it sparse you don't want to be predictable with your jumping it's okay to jump in Street Fighter V. You can be predictable with your jumping because sometimes the other guy just isn't going to be on point and he's not going to knock you out of the air and you're going to get a huge-ass damage combo because he failed to knock you out one time. You know, it's, it's that weird kind of skewed stuff. There's all sorts of weird shit with the game, but generally that's what I hear and when I play it, really my problem is just Alex is bad. That's really why I don't like it. Because Alex is bad. And if Alex was good, I'd probably be playing a game. Again, Lord of Chaos likes the game. So, you know, ask him. He probably knows better why, you know, it's actually good or bad. My dog! Oh, my fucking dog! Oh, my fucking dog. 
My dog stopped me from... Oh, my God. My dog stopped me from killing that guy. Did you see that? That dog saved him. Ah, fucking Christ. My dog just killed me. My fucking dog. A literal bitch. Oh, wow, my controller's red. I only just noticed that. <laughs> the air anti-air doesn't work anyway. I've seen someone low attack and it... Yes, yeah, so one of the problems in Street Fighter V, if somebody jumps in on you, your designated anti-airs for a lot of characters are not good. They're very bad. Their hitbox and hurtbox, it's all fucked up. So if, like, a good example is Alex, right? If you try an anti-air with Alex, he's got three options. He's got a forward heavy fierce, which is a lariat. That's really good for more of a straightforward attack. Uh, he's got a crouching heavy fierce, which is this kind of an upwards pointing shoulder. That one's pretty good. Uh, and then he also has, <laughs> he has a DP motion that's a knee that catches them out of the air. So he does like a dragon punch with his knee. Uh, it can snag him out of the air for uh, an attack, basically. Those are his three anti-airs. You cannot use two of those. The Lariat, the Forward Heavy, and the Crouching Heavy. Those two will not work most of the time for a guy who's jumping in at you. Most of the time, they will miss. They will either miss or they will trade. Because those are his anti-airs, but they did not give it the priority that it needs. You know, it's hitbox, hurtbox. is so fucked up that if you try an anti-air from most any distance with those two moves, you're fucked. His dragon punch, his knee that catches out of the air, that one is actually pretty viable because it has an upper body invincibility. His feet, when he goes up in the air, is still able to be hit. But his upper body can't be hit. It's, we it's really weird, right? And if you EX it... It's so fast that it generally catches people really, really quickly and you're safe, you know? But the normal one is still kind of iffy, you know? it's You do have to gauge the distance from when they jump in at you. If they jump in really shallow, if they're really close to you and they jump in and they try and get your backside with like a cross up or something, generally you're not going to be able to hit them with even with your DP. You're just going to go underneath them. If they're really far away, your DP is not going to go far enough and catch them. It's, it's, you still have to know your ranges on that thing. So it's not an instant like, oh, I see he's jumping. I can just DP and be done. It doesn't work that way with Alex. Even with Ryu. But Ryu has more. You know, the Shoryuken is actually really good even for, like, you don't have to be as diligent with the DP. But for with Alex, you do. You have to be diligent. So all those three options are all trash, right? Now... In Street Fighter V, before this recent patch that came out a couple days ago, one of the things that you could do as an anti-air was simply jab. It was simply jab. The light attack button, crouching or standing, just jab. This jab had a hit in hurtbox. The hitbox was way high up, and the hurtbox was way low. So you had a really big threat right up here and if the guy jumped in on you anywhere from like your face past that jab would hit him out of the air and it didn't matter what they were doing it didn't matter what button they used it just worked most of the time they tried to nerf it and it was still one of the best anti-air options in the game especially for alex actually alex had an anti-air it was his jab his jab was one of the best anti-airs in the whole game it was so good then they nerfed everybody's jab and it wasn't as good but it was still alex's best anti-air despite his other three anti-airs being designated at anti-air they just didn't do the job very well jab did it better in a lot more situations etc etc they nerfed it again a couple days ago so at this point i am i imagine alex is not that great but still it's ridiculous to think that designated anti-airs are weaker at performing their job than a simple standing jab. <laughs> ridiculous, right? Super ridiculous. That's just... The, the Street Fighter V has all sorts of stories like that, where things are just anti-Street Fighter, they don't make sense, they're totally strange. They're just strange decisions. Now, I'm not trying to say, like, the game is utter trash or something like that. I think it is trash, but it's not utter trash. I think it could still be saved. But Capcom isn't really interested in making it a game worth saving. You know what I mean? 
They're not that interested. They're really fucking around with the game. They, they, they like, recently they nerfed Alex some more. Uh, and they nerfed a bunch of characters that really didn't need to be nerfed, supposedly. And then they buffed fucking uh, Cammy. They made Cammy buff. And Cammy's like a... Jesus, she's like a hoochie mama, you know? She's a, she's king of the hoochie mamas. She's super good. <laughs> like, super duper good. And they buffed her. Everyone's flabbergasted. The, the recent patch notes are just like, what in the hell happened here, you know? <laughs> Damn, that guy did not go down. Damn, there's a boat! That's a guy with a hat. That's a guy with a hat. I don't want to deal with him. Our boats? Did he say boats? He's got boats? I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, I can't do it. Fuck. I got really unlucky there. Is it because my dog? Yeah, I'll we'll give up. My dog's dead. Uh, what did you clip me here? You clipped me with something. What is this? So, you know, ask him. Better. Was this when I got shot? You dog. The fucking dog stopped me from doing. Oh. My dog stopped me from. Goddamn dog. The fucking dog! Whatever. Enjoy your clip, Freed. <laughs> Seriously, it was really fucked up. I mean, Street Fighter V could be a good game still, I think. It's just. They would really have to listen to the people who play Street Fighter. They just. I don't think Capcom's interested, though. I don't think they're interested in listening to people who play Street Fighter. I think they're more interested in figuring out how, how to be esports. I think that's what they're figuring out. Yeah, I'm getting a little too wild here. I gotta pay attention. <laughs> Your ass at shooters. I do hate first person shooters, to be honest with you. I don't, this is like my, one of my least favorite genres. It's boring, you know? It's boring, is what it is. I can't really enjoy it that much. But, I'm not ass at it. You take that back. I just had a couple of unlucky streaks, that's all. <laughs> Again, once I can take off these alarms, I'll be fine. Just gotta take out these alarms, that's all. They keep calling in backup and fucking me up, man. Am I on fire because I touched the barrel? Damn, she's in there? Hey, where's that other, uh... There's another... Uh, alarm, I gotta, I gotta knock out. There it is. It's right there. I kinda agree. Capcom should definitely leave the fighting game scene. I don't know what they should do with Street Fighter, though. The hell was that? Did you hear that? Alright, all the alarms are dead. That means that I could fuck this up and we'd be good. Damn, 
Damn, how did that blow up? How did that blow up? Oh my god, I didn't think that could happen at all. Is my dog dead? My dog's alive. Wake me up. Lick my crotch. Oh yeah, give me the fellatio. That's the good stuff. Oh fuck. Oh fuck! Oh fuck me, get out of here. Do you see that? The dog gave me fellatio. I woke up. Thank God, Jesus, I was just panicking trying to get that damn thing to trigger. There we go. Not too bad, not too bad. I just had to take it a little bit easier. We were talking about Street Fighter V. <sighs> no, it's, FPS can be interesting. I just have no faith that anybody has, can make it interesting these days. No faith. I haven't seen an FPS game that's really turned me on in... I can't even think the last FPS game that really turned me on. This game had some kind of fun shit in it, but it's grown... It, like you said, it's it's open world, limited guns, it, it's getting pretty pretty boring. You know, it's just running through. I'm thinking of dropping it. But... I can't think of the last FPS game like I really, really got into. Or at least like I really enjoyed. I don't know. Who's he talking about? Please to make your acquaintance. That guy? Appreciate all your help getting my marina back, but honey, I got a problem. Those Peggy shipbirds stole my tulip. She's the nimblest goddamn helicopter this side of Montana, and I'll be The butts are kind of nice in the game. Are gonna take I didn't know me. chicks in the, oh, you know, middle America had square. nice asses, but boy. Walking erect not bad. This function who took her painted her that awful shape. Okay, okay. Don't care how you do it, but I need my chopper tulip back and those doomsday dildos that stole her taken care of. Yeah, I don't know, man. I, you could probably end it, but Street Fighter is Street Fighter. People are always going to want more. You know what I mean? Our scouts have found a plane at the Lansdowne airfield. Kingdom Never Came is your favorite FPS. First person shooter? Kingdom Never Came? Something doesn't quite add up there, too late. <laughs> First person shooter? What? Who is this guy? Why has he got a gun? Why is he wearing flip flops? Thanks for helping out my county jail, buds. Something tells me he's a little flamboyant. Look at that. Yeah, he shaves his armpits. Yeah, this dude is definitely a little, uh, swimming on the wild side, I think. I'm going to leave that guy go. I didn't play Team Fortress 2, or Killing Floor. I played Team Fortress 1. That was pretty fun. Way back in the day. What am I doing? Oh, I gotta go beat up these things. Hey, do I have, like, um... Do I have, like, a boat? Our scouts have found a plane at the Lansdowne airfield. Is there a now boat? all we need to do is There's a boat the there. Helicopter, that's why. What, what do you say? We Fire, look out, and hunting support. shack. Cool. Alright. Let's make sure I have my uh shit bought up. Yeah, you did have a bow in it. Wow. <laughs> Alright. I suppose. <laughs> I guess. It's not like I can say no to that, I suppose. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know about Street Fighter. I try really hard to be... I wanted. I really wanted Street Fighter V to be, you know, the one that I tried to be good in. But I couldn't do it. It's really hard to do. And I'm going to be trying it again. I'm going to go back to Street Fighter V when Cody comes out. I'm going to try. Go back and play some Cody. I just... <laughs> I don't know. I really wanted it to be the game that got me into Street Fighter, but maybe I'm just not a Street Fighter guy. Maybe the idea of Street Fighter just isn't really that good. <laughs> I mean, people are gonna want to see it though. Yeah, maybe there could be do it. They could do something less hard scale. But here's the thing: 
Street Fighter V as a game sucks, right? But as an esports scene, it's thriving. And I mean, it's making money. Esports? Street Fighter esports is real. It's very real. And that's because Capcom puts a lot of money behind it. Tournaments are real. Everything's real. It's very, very serious stuff. Uh oh. Bad guys. I don't want them to blow up my. I don't want them to blow up my helicopter. Team Fortress Classic? No, it was just Team Fortress back when I played it. I don't know what this classic is you speak of. Did they blow up that helicopter, or can I steal it? They probably blew it up. Don't you dare. Let's play Street Fighter V again. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. I really want to try Cody. <laughs> I might not go online, but I'm at least going to try Cody. <laughs> I love that I fly off without my dog. <laughs> I might not go online, I might just do some training mode, do some trials, and then that's that, you know. We'll see how it goes, man. That's all. <laughs> I, I don't know. I really wish I could have gotten into Street Fighter, I guess. I have played every other fighting game. Well, not every, but I've played a lot of other fighting games, and I have learned how to kind of get into there and figure things out. I never figured out Street Fighter V. I, I don't understand what people are doing. I don't understand what I'm trying to do. And none of it makes any sense when, like, in practice, you know? Like, the, the lessons of Street Fighter don't translate well into Street Fighter V. You have to play it in a way that's just vastly different than what I'm used to. Not even used to. Just want to learn, right? Every time I, like, did good in that game, I always wondered, like... Why did I do good? This guy should have just blocked, you know? Every single time I won, it didn't feel like I won because I was good. It just felt like I won because the other guy refused to play right. <laughs> and I didn't know what to do. And when I did find the guy that would, like, play correctly, you know? The way that I think you're supposed to play. I still wasn't really sure what to do. Why do I keep doing this? I keep running into the one fucking guy who can blow the shit out of my face. And then I run up to him, and he blows the shit out of my face, and I'm like, why do I do this? The hell is wrong with me? Damn, this is fucked up. That was kind of cool looking, I'm going to admit. Nice. Alright, that was, that was the big threat. Did I up there or something? Oh, shit, what? Damn, he's fucking me up from the, the rafters. You know you're dead. Nice. Got him with the melee. Got him with the melee. Took a little bit of work. <laughs> I don't want that. Oh, shit. I don't want that at all. Mmm... 
Damn, did you guys see that fucking movie, uh, Ready Gamer 1? <laughs> I didn't see it, but I've been seeing, uh, screenshots and shit of it. It looks... It looks so pandery. <laughs> that shit is so much about pandering to gamers, I couldn't even believe it. Like, they have Chun-Li and the Overwatch chick in the front. Oh my god. I almost barfed when I saw that. I was like, oh, man. It's just, it's such a... It's such a us gamers, huh? Kind of look to it. <laughs> oh, my fucking dog is gone. All right, pounce and stalk. Eh, what else do I? Have? I don't need, ah, fuck it. I don't want anybody else. It's the dog enough. Normie, fucking. It's like a serious normie movie. I couldn't stand it. I was so surprised. I wasn't surprised at all. What movie? It was called uh, Ready Player One. <laughs> It had, like, a Halo scene or something in it. I don't even know. I think Dante from Devil May Cry might have been in it. I'm not sure. I think I think he takes a selfie picture with some cat chick with huge tits. <laughs> She's got huge fucking milkies. And, like, Dante just, like, moseys on up to the big titty cat lady. Be like, you want to do a selfie? Bam. And then he just moves on. <laughs> like, what is even going on? I don't understand what the movie is. I think it's like everybody lives in a virtual reality world and they all decide to look like their favorite video game characters. That's all I know. I don't know anything else about the movie. And then I saw these pictures and like these little clips and stuff. I'm like, this is not, this is not bueno. <laughs> this is not something I want to watch. No way, Jose. This fucking Halo scene and shit. Who even, who even remembers Halo at this point, right? Halo's dead. Halos is about as dead as Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. Jeez. This helicopter does not move. Sounds good, I'm gonna watch it tomorrow. Wow, Jesus Christ, you are such a normie. I hope you get some chicken tendies too, Tillin, I really do. I wish you the best of luck with your sexual experience with your significant other, who is probably a woman. And uh, I hope you perform coitus properly in the missionary position for the sole purpose of procreation. I hope too that that goes swimmingly. Because you're such a normie. When you find that bastard, wait till he lands my baby tulip. Then rip that son of a bitch's pecker off and bring my sweet tulip home. Don't hurt my darling chopper. She seriously doesn't want me... Oh, boy. She doesn't want me to hurt the chopper. She just wants me... to grab the guy's penis. <sighs> this is not gonna go well. I gotta go over there. This sounds like a stealthy mission. I wish I had my dog, but he's gone. I'm hoping to see Hi Hachi, huh? I think that's a really hard bet to win. That doesn't seem like a good bet to me. Trying to get the Hachi? I don't think it's gonna work out. Plenty of Hoochie, I'm sure, but Hachi? I don't think so. Are you serious? What the fuck? So as soon as I get here, he's gone? Man, that's shitty. So do I have to, like, wait here or something? why it keeps pulling out the rocket launcher. I want this, and I want this. Don't stop fucking with me. Do you think he'll come back? 
I don't know if I can hit this guy. Ledge takedown. Damn! That was kind of cool. I didn't know you could do that. That was kind of cool. I'll give it up. Do you think he'll come back over here if I wait long enough? Tekken is for normies. There's no way Tekken is for normies. Best fighting game? I agree entirely that it is the best fighting game out there right now. Absolutely. You will get absolutely no argument from me on that point for sure. That shit is super fun. Even though lately I've been having a hard time with it, I am so happy about Tekken. Because it is fun. Shit, I gotta hide. Just punch him and leave? Alright, that works. I'm out of here. Damn, there's a machine gun on this thing. See that? Machine gun is R2. I want to shoot some bitches. Good to go. Honey, the minute you finish everything, bring my tulip back here. And if Tech you need something you don't like on the right back, feel free to fire up tulips mounted guns. Them beauties pack more punch than a bull in heat. Seriously? A bull fucking? These things are stronger than a bull that wants to fuck. I don't think so. There is nothing in this world stronger than a bull that really needs to procreate. Nothing. It's like retard strength. <laughs> what fighter I play? I play Fang, man. I guess I've been playing Noctis more than Fang right now, though. But I'm done with Noctis. I had my fun with that tweak. Alright? That femboy. Whatever they call him. Didn't we used to have a guy in here, a bear player, that would, like, was a femboy or something? I can't remember. Yeah, for real. Damn, I gotta take this chopper out. I'm not doing a very good job. I got it. I did a great job. So, that kind of, I got kind of fucked up a little bit. Damn, I'm all injured and shit. Alright, let me go lay down. And, uh... I can repair this bitch. Don't worry. Don't worry. I have a degree in repairing every machine ever with a torch. Just a torch. I don't need anything else. I don't need rotors or any of that nonsense. I can just flat out repair a vehicle. Because I'm that good at, at, at this shit. Alright, check this out. I do this. I grab this. Look at that shit. Certified mechanic. But only with a torch. I don't know how to do anything else. But boy, once I have that torch in my hand, shit's golden. I play EX Lair. <laughs> Fighting EX Lair. Let's not joke around about that, okay? That company is in serious problem. Alright? Serious problem! They're in serious problem if they don't sell that game. Do you realize that? Oh my god. They are in so much trouble if they don't sell that game. Their whole entire company is going to go bankrupt if that game doesn't sell. And that means selling the $60 price point version of the game. Not the weird $30 version that gives you, like, less than half the gougie and, uh, you know, fucking one less character. I swear. They are so much in trouble. They are so much in trouble. They, they have so much problem. Unbelievable how much problem they have. Are you going to buy it? I kind of want to buy the $60 version just to support them. I feel so bad. They put their entire company's life savings in stock, right? They busted open the piggy bank. Their dad was like, you, you're going to bust open your piggy bank? And they were like, yeah. We're going to do it for the FGC, bro. <laughs> like, what the fuck is an FGC? <laughs> I feel so bad for that. Like, they basically guilt me into buying their game. I don't even know or care if it's going to be any good. <laughs> oh, 
fuck? What is going on here? What the hell's going on here? Why is everyone being a bitch? That was dope, though. I hit two people with that. Did you see that? Two people? Damn, he's still going? Get down, bitch. Woo! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, oh, no, no, no. Ow! Fuck, I got hit. You got like a mounted gun somewhere around here? No. Why would they risk it all? They they risked it all because Arika has Arika managed to save like a lot of their assets from the last game. You got to understand like the assets in the current game are literally models and everything taken from the old games. They just imported them into new graphic engines. And stuff. They they so the, the I'm not even kidding, man. They're they're entire like art asset and everything was pulled out of the old ass games that's wild that's fucking wild so they gathered as much money as they could and they're releasing it as much as they can and, like it's fucking amazing they're, they're trying to, they're actually trying to bank on the whole thing to see if like people like it you know pretty damn wild <laughs> yeah, that's amazing, right? They're actually removing the light. I kind of want to go play it now. I want to go buy it on PC and do a uh, Nemesis version run of that game. Sounds pretty fun, doesn't it? No loot boxes? It's pretty dumb. But yeah, anyways, like, Arika is fucking completely... They're, they're heavily invested in to make sure their game is good because they use their old ass art assets and everything. Like, they recycled as much as they own. <laughs> it, that's why it looks so like, you know, low tier garbage. When you look at the game, it's, it looks like a hash, some sort of something you made on butt hash. It looks like it came out of somebody's asshole. It just mixed a bunch of art assets together and pooped out a fighting game. Because that's basically what they did. <laughs> as wild as that is. But people are, like, excited, man. They're excited for that. My aiming is not trash. What are you fucking... You're just pissed because I'm not playing Dankest Dungeon. Fucking... Talking shit over there, huh? Jesus, fuck! That is one guy! Why are you using a rocket for one person? What is wrong with you people? He fired a fucking rocket at one single individual. Messed up dude. And he will quiet you with his love. Did you say he will quiet you with his love? Is that right? I'm sure that's right. And now we have a fucking helicopter. Oh, we got an air pain. Got an air pain. Fighting never stops. Can't talk to her. Fighting never stops. Who's this guy? Why is he dead? Damn, checking that out. You looking at that? Wow! Damn. <laughs> oh, I probably should help her out. Alright, there you go. Ooh, <laughs> I'm starting to sweat over here, Internet. <laughs> it's getting a little warm in here, or is it just me? <clears throat> Mighty beautiful Goyle. Beautiful Goyle. Bitch. Can I talk to you yet? Are you in like constant fucking angry mode? Yeah, he's angry. Didn't think those assholes would come back so soon. 
<laughs> Damn, I'm not hard of reading. I just don't like to read. I just don't like it. Slap my tits and call me Shirley. Do you have titties? Now, I always keep my word. So, if you need a pilot who can shoot the dick off a gopher from 50 feet in the air, I'm your gal. You call me anytime, except around sunset. Xander likes to do yoga around then, and I like to watch. You ain't lived until you've seen that ass and downward facing dog. Anyways, thanks again, hon. I owe ya. Hi, sweet cheeks. Basically, I just talked to Lord of Chaos here. Downward facing dog. Basically, I just did a mission for two, uh, Lord of Chaos. I was gonna say Tulug, but I don't think Tulug knows how to do downward facing dog. That's a position that's a little beyond him. Only for now, though. He'll get around to it eventually. Just takes a little bit of practice. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if anybody likes that game. Freed, you're legitimately like the first person I've heard who likes that game. I don't know anybody who actually likes that game. It's just a weird game. But, I mean, I've never played it, so I can't really be all that judgmental. So I'm not. But I don't hear a lot of people like it. I don't know why. I don't know why. I just never really cared to figure it out. From time to time, even myself. What's going on here? Oh, that fucking bitch is talking again. I don't give a fuck. Hey, help me out, buddy. Stop talking to me, ghost girl. Just stop it. I hate how this interrupts you, man. Like, you're just trying to do some shit. And fucking this bitch out of nowhere either knocks you out, drugs you, or starts talking to you in your head. You gotta help me. Oh, man. No, but I like putting in my uh, two cents where it's not wanted for you. You know that. You know that about me. That's why you come and join me all the time. <laughs> Man. You guys would be so bored if I didn't let you guys shit talk, right? You know how many streams out there, like, would ban all you people the moment you entered chat? Oh, man. You guys really hit it big entering my stream, I'm telling you. The least you can do is fucking send me death threats, alright? I want to feel wanted too, just like my favorite streamer, Maximilian. I shot on Marvel. I shot on Marvel twice in two different videos. What did I get? I got one video where Smash players were trying to tell me that Smash is a fighting game that belongs at Evo. Bunch of bullshit. In the second video, I think I got some people that were pissed that I said Marvel sucks. I forget what happened in that second video, but I didn't get any death threats. Fucking Christ. Least you can believe what they're doing? Instead of giving me this weird Jewish flower. <laughs> Instead of giving me death threats, you post this fucking Jewish flower. <laughs> Goddamn Eris subs, I swear. Red named having Eris subscribing. <laughs> Man, Tula, did you see that fucking thing? Goddamn reality show with two, with low tier god in it. It's got low tier god guilty and Sherry Genix, top eight hot dogs herself. It's a fucking uh, reality TV show, dude. I can't believe it. Low tier god, man. Ultra David is so pissed about that. He wrote a whole fucking diatribe on Twitter about how pissed he was that low tier god. Represents Street Fighter V players on TV. I'd be pretty pissed too, honestly. <laughs> I'd be pretty pissed. Just a wee bit. I can't use this? This is not mine to use. Oh, wow. Fuck, I have to buy it. Do I have the money? I don't have any money, right? <laughs> it's crazy, Tulet, I swear. I don't know. It's going to be boring as hell, though. It's going to be boring, and then maybe maybe there's some drama, but it's just going to be boring. Tulip? I help Xander? Oh, okay. I have to help Xander first. All right. But I can't steal the one that's here? That is so awful. That is not video game, sir. I thought this was an open world. Can I grab a boat? 
I'll grab an airplane just to get going. I've got a job for any fisherman who got time. Fisherman, I love fishing. Giant albino it's like the only thing in this game that's actually kind of fun. Locals call him Ragnar the Terrible. Dike People have been trying to catch old Ragnar for ages, but he's damn stubborn. He likes to hang out by that little island. Really want yonder. coffee. It'd be good for morale. Freak of gullet. How come you randomly have oh caps God, lock? What, what was it again? I think you explained it once before that your keyboard breaks or something. I can't remember. Or maybe it's your, uh, maybe you're on mobile. I can't remember what you said, but you just randomly, every once in a while, you just have full cap locks. <laughs> it's the weirdest thing. It, it's almost like you have, uh, it's almost like you have Tourette's. <laughs> It's almost like you have the chat version of Tourette's. You, can, you just randomly out of nowhere, you just start shouting in caps locks. <laughs> <I love laughs> oh man, <laughs> Tourette's isn't funny, but I still laugh at it. Oh boy. All right, super offensive, super offensive. Oh, all right. Let's uh, let's get in this let's get in this weird boat. Oh boy, give me the weird boat. Give me the weird boat. The hell are those? Drink kombucha? There's no way. Not in a million years. You know that. Damn, I actually have a machine gun. What the hell are all those? Tiny ass emotes? What the fuck? Who did you sub to to get those? Oh, I didn't reach the location. Shit, I fucked up. Boomer's just swimming in the water, huh? Okay. Yeah, I want to turn around. Turn me around. Set me down. Yeah, it's good in the water. Okay. Who cares? It's good in the water. Yeah, my key sticks. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry, I thought it was like you had a problem or something, like the damn thing wouldn't work. I thought you were on mobile or something. Whatever. It's all good, bro. Mm. What the fuck is a bear doing out here? Why is a bear here? Is he swimming in the water? Look at that bear! Damn! He gonna catch him some fish. <laughs> He's gonna catch some fish the old-fashioned way. But I'm gonna shoot him. It's not working very well. <laughs> yeah, I got him. The the attraction of blood in the water will uh will give me some fish. What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm trying to fish! How did I pull out dynamite? What the hell? This game is whack. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to fish and I pulled out dynamite. <laughs> These emotes are from my channel. You don't have a channel, you loser. Do you have a channel? <laughs> is it more popular than mine? You don't have a channel. You butthole. You're fucking with me is what you're doing. Oh, there we go. I forgot what, what button that was supposed to hold. Damn, that was super fucking easy. Catch the albino huh. paddlefish. Oh, that's what I'm trying to okay. Woo! Damn, that went far. I like fishing in this game. I like fishing in this game. This is a really fun thing to do. It's pretty chill. You can level it up a little bit. Like, you can find some hard places. It's really fun. That's not what I needed. Where's the albino, uh, where's the white bitch? Hey, where are all the white fish at? Is it that? It's animated pretty good too. Oh, this one's actually fighting me. Alright, let's do it.
Damn. This one's like kicking my ass though. You see this? This thing is totally kicking my ass right now. Whoo! There we go. I just had to tire it out. Oh my god! You see this shit? That thing had like a fucking uh, penis for a nose. What the fuck? Ooh, silver snake. Hosted you with my stream? Hey, thank you, man. Damn. Hey, I think I saw you watch. Or I think I saw you playing uh, Tekken a while ago. Good shit. You know, I, I think I'm done with... Uh, did you play Noctis at all, though? I think you were just playing King last I saw you. I'm done with Noctis. I don't think I like him that much. Anyways, thanks for the host, man. I appreciate that. That's good shit. Just in time, too, to see the fish with a penis for a nose. That's pretty dope. Not everybody gets to see that. Now you get to see what I do with it, but only if you subscribe. I'm afraid you only get to see what I do with this, pe <laughs> this penis-nosed fish unless you're a Tier 2 sub. Not even Tier 1. I'm sorry, but it's just, uh, whatever I do with this fish, it's very secretive and I can't let the world know. So very, very, uh, very careful. I, only a select few are, are able to bear witness. Where'd my boat? Oh, there it is. Fucking, what's, what's pissed out there? Oh, man, you're pissed out there? All right, fuck you. I'll just go back in. Damn. <laughs> how's, your, how's your stream go, dude? What were you doing? Nah, just geese and king at savior level. Jesus Christ. You're so fucking buff compared to, like, me and Tula. It's ridiculous. Get out of here. This guy's trying to shoot me. He's trying to kill me. Maybe I can go back and kill him. Huh? Where'd he go? Did he despawn? Oh, that's fine. Oh shit, I'm in Jacob's territory. I don't want to be in here. It's the next level shit. Damn, I think that was an airplane. It might have been another airplane. Damn, alright, I don't see it. Whatever, fuck it. <laughs> PUBG and Tekken, that's all I really play. PUBG? Uh, I don't know about PUBG. I mean, it's probably... I don't know. It, it was not trash when I first saw it, but I haven't seen it since. <laughs> Where am I going? Uh, let's go do Clutch Nixon? Alright, fuck it. We'll do Clutch Nixon. Oh! Just about lost my shit there. Jesus Christ. Am I in the... Oh, that's the wrong region! I don't want to go to that. Fuck that. For real? That's hella wrong region. These mountains are Eli and his whitetail militia. I don't want to be a part of that. Hmm. Damn, you see that pocket? Damn, do you see that? Hey, which one's the enemy? I think you're the enemy. God damn, fucking hit this bitch. Nice, I got him. Oh yeah, he's done. Yeah, you see that bitch? Yeah, he's down. Watch him crash. Nice. Showed him one. This game is really boring. <laughs> Just to let you guys know. It's pretty boring. I'm not enjoying it very much. Let's get out of this plane. Where am I going? In here? Pop the shoot. Oh! Jesus Christ, that startled me. What happened? How did I fucking hit the ground like that? I had the parachute out. 
Jeez, it looked like I dropped super fat. Whatever. I hate this game. <laughs> I hate this game. This game is just... It's boring. FPSs are boring, man. I can't stand them. Halo 2 Xbox. Man, nobody's talking about Halo anymore, right? What happened in the last one? Halo 5? I guess Halo 6 would be next, but... Damn, it saved me in the airplane? Alright, that's cool. Halo... I haven't heard damn thing about Halo 5 at all, other than people being disappointed. It's sad to hear. It's kind of cool that you can look inside the vehicle. Oh, that is really cool. I like that a lot. I'm just gonna pop this shit right away. Last time did not go well. Why am I doing this anyways? Uh oh. Those are trees. Uh oh. Yeah, that's a tree. Find the stash. Oh, you guys were not here a second ago, you know that? Died out after three, but you gave the rights to Microsoft and moved on. All right, that's probably why. That's actually a very good reason as to why. What is that? Creepy. What that was? Like a hyena? Oh no, it's a wolf. I'm looking for the stash. Searching for the stuff. Hmm. Is this stuff? No. Hmm. Is this stuff? No. Where's the stuff, me boy? Man, it's dark as hell in here. Do you see the stash somewhere? No? Hmm. Oh, check that out. Hmm. Really? Competitive scene was leaving? Call of Duty. <laughs> it's weird to think Call of Duty is, uh... Considered like that. It is trash, isn't it? Oh my god. What was the, I mean, I kind of liked Advanced Warfare 2, though. I was into that. But pretty much everything after Modern Warfare... No, did I say Advanced Warfare? I meant Modern Warfare. Modern Warfare 2, Beyond Modern Warfare, that whole shit was just, like, garbage. Pure garbage. And then they fucking tried to get people on board with that weird shit. Where it was like, hey, if you buy this one... Oh my god, am I, am I dead? Oh no, I'm okay. If you buy uh, Advance, you can get the uh, you can get the Modern Warfare 2 remake or something. I'm like seriously, I like that. Always been a Battlefield guy. Battlefield's good. You know, I gotta take that back. I like Battlefield 2, but I only ever really liked Battlefield 2142. That was my jam. Hang on, I got I got a battle. Got a battle to win. What if I don't want any mercy? What if I just want the vomit? Did you just say your soul is garbage? Well, your life is trash, bitch. Soul is garbage. Your soul is garbage? Garbage. It's a good line. I like that. Nobody else around you? Why do I keep pulling out the fucking rocket launcher? That's so weird. Just give me the damn handgun. It's the last one I was using. Oh, he did. Mm. Dog Naturals. Weird. <clears throat> Man, that would be really good, right? 2142 coming back. That'd be really dope. I love that game. There, I think I tried playing that game. It was like... 
I I tried playing that game uh, after the expansion. I can't remember what it was, but they had like a weird expansion that was all like frost levels or something, and it was really good. I liked it a lot. What's Boomer doing in there? Animal control. Oh, wow. Prepper treasure. Wow, I was doing a prepper stash the whole time. Give me the money. Nice. Give me the money. Hmm. Anything else that's cool in here? No. Mm, how do I get this helicopter out of here? Can I just go straight up? This is gonna be weird. I don't just go straight up. Can I just go? All right, we're just gonna go straight up. I'm just gonna do this with my arms, and if you're in my way, you're gonna get hit. Oh my god, do I have to like seriously navigate this thing? Oh my gosh. Uh, don't hit the tree! Oh, do not tree! Oh yes, we're good. Did not tree. Can I shoot? How was that? Did I do that? I don't think I did that. That's fun. Ugh. Yeah, this Far Cry stuff is not fun. This story is based on Waco. I don't even think it's based on Waco. I think this story is trash, is what I think. Basically, the story is the... Basically, the story is some bullshit. A bunch of angry cults, and you shoot them. That's about it. That's it. And then, like... The story is just you helping out a bunch of people who are like, Yeah, these cult people are crazy. Shoot them up. Kill them. Do everything you want to. Molest their bodies. Before or after death. Whatever. They're cultists. They deserve worse. That's that's everybody's attitude in the game. And that's it. You just blow shit up and fucking... You're trying to, like, save your buddies or something. Because you're a cop. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Yeah, there we go. Are these... Hey, totes forgot to mention. Laptop's gonna connect to the GPS on their boats. Smart, right? So, like, find the computer, find the boats... Then we find their containers. Then you blast them to dust. Yeah. Oh god. That was close. That was close. This music is trash. Did my dog die? Stand up, bitch. Who's sleeping on the job? What? A what? Can they do what to my ass? Uh oh, that's a grenade. Where'd the other guy go? There was a second dude in here. My dog is like totally dying a lot. Wake up. Sleeping on the job, huh? Uh oh. Sounds like he's right here, but. Am I dead? My dog is dead. I think. Oh no! I got you. I got you, buddy. Here you go. The dog is not helping me a whole lot this time. What am I doing here? Besides, about to get fucking burnt alive by a fire that I created. Wait for the hack to finish. All right, we're waiting. Oh my God, the fire is still going. GPS lock. Now we can track those boats. You should take to the skies and follow the signal. Did I grab a different gun? How did I do that? Give her a shout and she'll zip right to you. Get that eagle eye view and find those bliss containers. I have no idea what this guy's even talking about anymore. How did I get this different gun? Can I get a different gun, please? I don't like this one. I mean, it's all right. I just don't want it. How did I even get it to begin with? What did I do? Oh, take that, thanks. Where's 
Where's my dog? Oh. Damn. Smoke grenade? Probably gonna help you. Hang down there! <laughs> yeah, it's fun for just being Far Cry, but I mean, it's not really a good... Not really like a good game, though. You know what I mean? I mean, it's just Far Cry, right? I'm so sure you guys have played Far Cry before. I never did. This is my first one, and that's the only reason why I've played it for this long. Because it is kind of fun just running around and shooting shit up, but I'm bored of it. To be honest with you, I'm pretty tired. And I have I have to finish this region, and then I have one more entire region to finish, and then I beat the game. But it's like, I don't really want to do it. <laughs> I'm only doing it tonight because I fucking... I, I'm supposed to be in bed. But I, I can't seem to go asleep, so I decided to fucking stream. What am I gonna do? Yeah, I figure out what I'm doing next. I don't know, this guy was like, go do stuff, and it didn't give me anything. It's a Charles something or other, okay. We'll go do that, but I need to... I need to summon... Helicopter. Can I get any guns here? No. Yeah? No. Okay. Get my chopper back. Ugh. I think Dice B might be working on Battlefield 5. I think this is a less fun just cause. Uh, I would only say that simply because in. Far Cry, or not Far Cry, in uh, Just Cause 3, you get a hang gliding suit just like in this one, but the hang glider is, it's not, it's not a hang glider, it's a wingsuit, wingsuit. You get a wingsuit just like in this one, but in this one, the wingsuit is really not that fun. It's actually kind of shitty. You don't really use it for much. You can't really play with it or anything. In Just Cause, you can do a lot of cool shit with your fucking wingsuit. I love that one. Super fun. <laughs> Stop playing it. Listen, man. I don't think I have a whole lot longer to stream tonight. I'm sorry. It's like 110 or 118 or something. I'm just playing it because I have nothing else to play tonight. I'm way too tired, or at least I'm trying to get tired. I'm, I'm definitely getting there thanks to this game. I'll probably wrap up stream in like, I don't know, probably less than an hour or something. I can't even... I'm not supposed to be uh, streaming this late. By the way, it's good seeing you again there, Sin. <laughs> I'm not even supposed to be playing this late, but... I didn't get tired, and I was like, fuck it, I'll stream something. I didn't stream today. I felt kind of bad about that, so I had to do something. Jesus! What did I just fall into? Can I not... Can I not grab you? Oh, man. I don't know what just happened. I don't know what just happened. But I got a rocket launcher, so, uh, fuck these guys. Don't kill innocents. My bad. Why do I have that in my... Oh, what? what? How am I on fire right now? Right, get in the water. Fire can't hurt you in the water. Oh, boy. I don't know what's happening anymore. Everything's on fire, and I can't tell what's going on. Apparently I lost my cool weapon, too. Where's that helicopter? There's one. Damn! That was dope. Oh god, there's a mortar. <laughs> Saved my ass a little bit. How 
am I on fire still? How am I still on fire? Jesus. I gotta save my dog. Where is that, my dog? I've been swimming in butt hash again. Where are you? There you go. This guy go down a lot, but he finds people for me. I can't help it. Damn! I got him. He roasted my dog, but I got him. All right. Yeah, how's it going, buddy? <laughs> I have plenty of other things. I suppose I do. I just don't want to do any of them. Thank you for saving me. My name is Dr. Charles Lindsay. I'm part of a group hold up south of here at the old jail. Faith That's and pretty fun. have been trying to get to us for days. I was out here looking for a way to stop them when the cult took me. Yep, yep, I think yep, I found yep, a way. Yep, yep, okay, yep. look. They threw my bag into the water. It's got the key to controlling these angels. You gotta get it for me. Okay. I'm gonna do that, no problem. Did you hear that? Sounded like a fucking elephant. What was that? That was an elephant. Nice. Hmm. Weird. Damn, there's a mortar here? Damn, you actually have a dive animation for jumping in the water. I never noticed that. Oh man, I gotta really sniff out. Okay, this is gonna be rough. It's okay though. I have the perk that lets me that lets me breathe longer underwater. So no problemo. Right down there. I got it. Uh oh, I'm losing air. It's getting nasty. Okay, we're good. I have to secure the area yet again. A damn good shot. Oh, God, get out, get out. Jeez. Fighting chance against Joseph Seed's brain dead goon now. <laughs> Sorry, my name's Yeah, it's helpful that the water lets me get underneath that shit. I'm not that kind of doc. What the hell? What? I need help, please! What? What's going on? Oh my dog's dead. Fuck. Uh are you really gonna die on me? Unavailable. It's like ten minutes to get him back. Why'd that guy panic? Are you still panicked? What's wrong? You're in conflict, huh? All our lives. Seriously. Wait, just talk okay. to me right now. Just hear me out. Sorry, I'm gonna skip my name's this. Charles. Everyone just get me the missing ingredients. I'll be back at the jail working on the formula for the angel bird. There we go. What are we talking about now? Undamaged black bear skin and prong horn skins. What was that? Let's see if I can hit some of these dudes with this thing here. Man, that's really far, though. Huh. Farther than I can aim this thing. That's weird. How come he's on my radar? Aim with this guy. I want to place you right here. Ooh. 
Wow. That could not have been more perfect. I was literally dead shot on that guy. Damn, you saw that coming? Huh. Wild. Alright. Black bear skin. Hmm. Black bear skin, huh? Where am I gonna get a black bear? Why is he gotta be black, though? Oh, they're way over there. Alright. Hmm. Why is he gotta be black, though? Let's go over here. Uh, let's go get peaches. I think I already got peaches. The co the the cougar, the cougar milf. I already got her. I'm not using her though. I guess I could go use her. It's not a bad idea. I like using the dog because he spots everything, and I don't have to look for them. It's easy peasy. It's basically it's basically the dog from uh, Metal Gear Five, right? Okay, I got a GPS lock. Now we can track those boats. You should take to the skies and follow the signal. Addie's got her chopper all fired up. Give her a shout and she'll zip right to you. Whatevs. I need to get my weapons back because I got all fucked up. Okay. I want, uh... Let's see, I already have... Ooh. Sawed on, I want to know. Damn, that's a pistol? Cool. I kind of like using the Magnum. It's not that great, though. We'll keep it. We'll keep that, and then uh, I need to get the other one. Where's the other one? Yeah, here's my AK. Uh -huh. And then I need to use the explosions. Aha! I can buy the better one. Damn, for all my money? Rocket Guide Rockets by Amy. Yeah, let's do it. I use it, so might as well fucking put it there. Perfect. Has a scope? This upgraded tactic will auto target vehicles? Okay, I don't have the money. Then eagle eye view and find those bliss containers. This already locks off the ship, though. Right? Wow, that actually did follow him. That's cool. Nice. All right, good shit. That's a lot better than the other one. What was I doing? Oh, that's right. I was gonna go get peaches, and then I was gonna go. I was gonna use peaches. Yeah, this one. There we go. I'll use the cougar milf, and we need to go to. This and this. Undamaged skin, undamaged skin. What's this? Undamaged skin. Let's do that. Do I have anything I can use? I think I have a helicopter on here. Yes. I'll make this quick. I figure if I do enough of these, we can go beat up the chick tonight, you know, the main chick, and then we'll have the last region left. And then either I'll quit the game or I'll come back and play it some more, I don't know. <laughs> I have a horrible time not playing shitty games, guys. I can't, I can't stand it. I have a horrible, horrible need to see my way through the end of every game I pick up. Even if that game is terrible. This game isn't terrible, it's just pretty boring. But, you know, I only got three days left until my job kicks in. I'm going to be starting work on Monday, and I have a morning routine to do. That's the scary thing. That's really the scary thing about all this, is that I will not have the free time that I had the last two weeks. And I streamed a shit one. Like, a lot. It was super fun. I'd love to do it some more, but obviously I can't. What is that? A goat? Hey, how are you supposed to even get up there? 
grapple point, maybe? Oh. Whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, okay, that was kind of cute. All right, I see how it is. Damn, that felt pretty good. Now I'm all like jittery and shit. Fucking the cougar likes me like a kitty. Whew, Who's talking right now? Man, there's someone making a bunch of noise. Oh, there they are. Damn, that is pretty gross. That is pretty gross, though. <laughs> Seriously tore that guy's throat out. That, that's pretty... That's pretty wild. Mm, but I'm not even here for people. I'm here for, uh... I'm here for weird, weird things. Damn, right into a mattress? Well, that's cool. Yes, I'll take the bow. Alright. So... We're looking for, uh... Hmm... We're looking for, like, animals, right? Fuck. What's a pronghorn? Is that porn? Hmm... How was that? The Wolverine. Ugh! Oh god, it's a bear! The hell is going on? Summons a bear? I don't need a bear, man. I need the weird thing. I mean, I guess I do need a bear, but I need a fucking black bear. I don't care about the browns. Brown things? I care about the black things. Fucking... At least summon the weird one that I need. Or give me this weird pronghorn thing that I'm looking for. <clears throat> anything. I don't know, usually the game gives me something by now. It's not usually that stingy when it comes to animals. <coughs> you know what? I think I have a go juice that lets me automatically tag animals and enemies. Yeah, alright. Bam. I got some butt hash that lets me see the animals. this one? Nope. Oh god. That might have been one. That might be one. Are you... Elk skin? Fucking that's not what I needed. Jeez. What the hell's a pronghorn? Hey, if you're out by the statue of Joseph, you should know that thing is hollow. Colt's using it to stash guns and ammo. If I were you, I'd find a way to blow it up. Hmm. Find a way to blow it up? Oh, he means that thing way up there? Yeah. I don't really care about doing extras. I just kind of want to, you know, get done. This is like a main quest here. It's just, uh... I'm not seeing any of the things I gotta kill. Hmm. 
There's one. Did you see it? Where'd it go? Fuck. Oh, fuck. Where'd it go? Man, my weird butt hash oil didn't make any difference. It didn't show up at all. Could have been an illusion. Hunting is tough. You just can't really get these guys to spawn, you know? Without my dog, too. Like, it doesn't flag them when they're close or anything like that. I thought my potion would do it, but it's not really doing it. Market for death. Damn. It's like limping? Cool. Got it. Is that a turkey? Yep, that's a turkey. Nice job. Killed the turkey. Well, we got one of the weird guys, so I just need to get another one. The thing is, is it showed up as a hallucination. Oh, check that out. Shit. They were being chased by the cat, so like, they were in full get the fuck out mode. Violence, huh? Jeez. Alright, give me another one. Give me another one. It's randomly generating enemies, so that at least gives me a shot. Not a very good one, though. Uh, there's a dude way down there. Damn, he's real? <laughs> Whoops. Where is he? Nope. Damn, I missed? Nice! Okay, you take care of that guy. I gotta loot this uh, ragstag doe. Where'd it go? Mm, where's the body? seem to have lost track of its body. Mm. 
Did it not slide down? Oh god. What the fuck, man? That was my out! Oh, man. Did it slide all the way down here or something? I mean... What? Oh my god. Did I seriously lose it? Man, it totally died though. Right? <laughs> this is so awful. I lost its corpse, man. Did you see its corpse? Is that it? No. It wasn't an illusion, right? Mm, this is not cool. Finally killed the second one I need. And uh, it pretty much disappeared on me. Problem is, is the body do disappear at some point. So it's kind of like... Yeah. Is that it? Nope, it's some weird rock shit. Kind of gone. Let's look up here really quick, see what the fuck's going on. Damn, real? Are you real too? Damn! This is not good. Damn! Get off me, bitch. Jesus. Fuck. Man. This is one of the damn deer that I shot. Can't even have that, huh? Well, I got the skin of a bison. That gave me another three perks. Joyous of joys, I guess. We got an arrow? Hmm? Is this like a misfired arrow, maybe? body kind of moves like that. Jeez. Shit popping up here, huh? Glad you made it to the jail in time. Saw a guy with a whole bunch of Fang Center <laughs> stuff being chased by Jacob's men. Oh, sure hope he made it. man. If you're over that way, just make it's definitely sure hitting me now. What time is it? 1.45? It's getting pretty close. I was really hoping I at least get this part done, but... Man, fighting one of these weird things is really tough. Or rather, finding it, killing it, and being able to loot it, apparently, is really tough. I mean, I killed one. I killed two, but I lost it. Lost it in the underbrush. Can I really not hunt it down in the bush there? rocks. Fuck. No good. No bueno. How about like way down here, huh?
Maybe I just chose a really, like, super underpopulated area. Let's see. There. Automatically tag everything. You know, I just realized I might not have done that the last time. I think I might have just crafted one. I didn't actually drink it. Wow. Does this really work like that? Uh-oh. Now I can't get up. Detecting stuff. Way up there, huh? That looks kind of like people, not not what I really need. what this is over here. Nope, that's not anything. What the? F hmm? Hmm. Damn, it's gone already? There it is. Damn! Got it. Perfect. I think I hit it too, so it should totally be, yeah. Nice! Sweet. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was about to go crazy. Ugh. Hunter's, uh... Ultimate Hunter, huh? Hmm. That worked out pretty good. We have to keep that in mind. Marshall trusted you. I trusted you. Is this what you do? I had big dreams for us. Together, we could have saved a Damn. I got pissed pretty quick. Alright. Uh, what's the last thing he needed me to do? Mm. Doesn't look like anything. Hmm. Alright, let's go back down here. Looks like those are the only ones I have left. Internet! I'm tired. That, uh, streaming has sufficiently done what I was hoping it would do and make me tired. So, yeah, uh, I didn't stream earlier today, which is kind of unfortunate, but at least I got something in here tonight, right? I will be back, hopefully tomorrow, tomorrow being today, which is Friday? Yeah, today's Friday. So I only have Friday, Saturday, and Sunday before I go back to having a job again this Monday. It is a morning routine, so this nightly stuff, I mean, it's its not supposed to be happening. And I just, I have no explanation hey, other than I, I've just been now pretty fucked up today. I'm just gonna save. Honestly, I don't know if I really want to come back to this game, but, like, if I don't have anything else that really stands out to me, then I will. Uh, I would have liked to have beaten it, but, you know, it, it's just... It's not very entertaining. I've kind of ran... I kind of had my fun with it. You know, I blew up a bunch of shit. I've been shooting stuff. And at this point, the weapons aren't really, like, grabbing me. The story is just a bunch of whatever. Uh, yeah. So, I don't know. 
I'll think about it. I'll definitely give it some thought because, you know, I don't really have a whole lot else I kind of want to run on. But I do have a PS2 emulator and a PS1 emulator. So I'm trying to think of some games I'd like to emulate, you know. Animusha 3 might want to go for that or something. But in general, uh, I'll figure all that stuff out. Of course, I still have all the go-tos of Tekken and yada yada. Mm, so yeah, thank you guys very much for hanging out with me tonight. Silver Snake with the host, four viewers. I appreciate that very much. Hopefully I was able to entertain you guys at least a little bit. Uh, I do apologize that I didn't stream much today because I am very tired and um, I'm busy today. It's going to be a little busy tomorrow too, so I don't know what's going to happen. But at some point I really got to buckle down and do like a real sleep schedule. I know I got to do that because I've just been, I've been really being a shithead and not waking up early in the morning. I mean the new job is literally like 6 or 7 a.m. And here I am being awake at 2 a.m. Like, this is not going to work out. Unless I decide to do this on Sunday and then just wake up after three hours sleep and then go to work, which, to be honest with you, is something that I have done more than one time. I actually do that quite often. At least I did back when I had to. We'll see how it goes. But listen, I more importantly, I appreciate you guys very much hanging out. Uh, I wish you all the best of luck, and I will see you next time, which is hopefully later Friday such as today. Have a good night.